Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. A very warm welcome to all of you. Welcome to the biggest news event of the year. A very warm welcome to Indian of the Year 2022. Ladies and gentlemen, it's an honor and privilege to host all of you for this special evening, the 12th edition of the Indian of the Year. And once again, I extend our special thanks to all of you for being a part of this evening. And before we begin this evening, can we have a huge round of applause for all you lovely audience, all the people. Thank you so much for being a part of the evening today. The pandemic brought the world to a screeching halt, but here we are today, once again to honor the journey of Indians whose contribution cuts an edge above the rest. Today we celebrate those who threaten a nation's belief in itself, who shine the brightest with their colossal achievements. The entrepreneurs who created the startup ecosystem and created unicorns during the economic gloom and doom. And icons from the world of cinema that have constantly metamorphosed to respond to the dynamically changing social realities. The stories of growth, grit, perseverance, innovation and ambition that fuel our nation's development shall be honored on this very stage today, ladies and gentlemen. So today we celebrate the Indians of the year and we begin this a evening. I am right now going to thank our sponsors, our presenting partner, RP Sanjeev Goenka Group, co-presenting partner, Reliance Industries Limited, associated partners, Policy Bazaar, Canara Bank, Signature Global. We'd also like to give you a polite reminder, please don't forget to use the hashtag Indian of the Year for your social media stories. If you put out these things on Twitter, use the hashtag for this coveted event, Indian of the Year. Well, let's also tell you a little bit more about the team, the entrepreneurs who will be honored, there, uh, honored here today, the climate change warriors, or the startup stories that we're about to share with all of you. These are people who often work in the background without much noise, they contribute to our ecosystem, whether it's our social changes, economic changes, or leading forward the path in the entertainment industry. All these people who have worked relentlessly, tirelessly, and fueled the nation growth uh, without much fanfare, without really getting hitting the headlines, these are the names that CNN News 18, Indian of the Year, today attempts to honor. And perhaps on this stage, you will hear a lot of stories which are about the growth, grit and determination and more so Griha in the age of the pandemic when it was so difficult for all of us to hold it all together. Absolutely Anusha we are coming back after four years so it is a grand celebration for us and this is something that we're truly looking forward to. The entire team of CNN News 18 and Network 18 has presented this and we're really really glad that all of you could be a part of this evening. Thank you so much once again for being here. And, and as we begin today's evening, here's the story that I'd like to reiterate, that CNN News 18 is the number one television uh, news channel. We have continued to maintain our dominance for the last 24 weeks, ladies and gentlemen, and not just on television, Reha, also on YouTube. That's the story that CNN News 18 presents, a story of leadership. Playing it out, see This is danger at our border. Lawrence Bishnoi plotted Mosewala's murder. India's most watched and respected news channel, CNN News 18, believes in investigation, not incitement. Forceful substance was given to Sonali Fogart. The most striking primetime lineup in English news television. News is about stories that believes in adding intensity. Biggest issue that we don't have a concept of nationhood. When others thrive in infamy. It has not been about a particular religious community. You don't want to accept the truth. You'll never solve the problem. India's most sought after newsmakers turn to CNN News 18. You may get a new challenge. Uh, it may ask much more of you but i think if you are fundamentally a competitive person you actually enjoy the challenge a testament of trust in the incredible news institution mananiya uddhav ji kehte the meri sarkar gira ke dikhao ek din maine keh diya bhai sahab jis din sarkar giregi aapko pata hi nahi chalega cnn news 18 has positively disrupted the ecosystem ushering in a new era of news broadcasting 
Ever since TV ratings returned after a year, CNN News 18 has towered over all its rivals for a staggering 24 weeks. CNN News 18 has emerged as the undisputed number one. Channels that claimed to have a dominance dwarfed by CNN News 18, revealing the real picture of news TV ratings. The numbers speak for themselves. CNN News 18 creating history with an unprecedented gap over its rivals. That's not all. CNN News 18 is revolutionizing the news space by becoming the first channel to enter an integrated news ecosystem that is exploding on the digital sphere. CNN News 18 has smashed records with 148 million views on YouTube. Unparalleled in the history of Indian news feeds. If views are skyrocketing, the subscription rate of CNN News 18 is growing at a staggering pace over competition. For China, the minute Nancy Pelosi landed in Taiwan, according to them, the damage has already been done. The biggest news events were followed on CNN News 18. The Super Tech Twin Towers, no more. They've been detonated. For every big event that impacted the world, CNN News 18 YouTube channel garnered never seen before views, setting an insurmountable benchmark in digital viewership. Tonight, CNN News 18 promises India that its passionate team is all set to transform India's news landscape with utmost integrity and a quest for constant innovation. CNN News 18, on your side. Thank you, the jury, and thank you, all the people who gave me this honor. I'm really humbled. I hope this inspires all the musicians uh, to play a larger role. This award uh, is mine, but I would take it on behalf of my entire cast and crew. Who will be the CNN News 18 Indian of the Year 2022 for Entertainment Category? Catch the grand finale of the most awaited news event, CNN News 18, Indian of the Year 2022. Where unpleasant realities and stinging truths will be addressed directly and bluntly. Where neutrality will not be used as a fig leaf to go soft on any side. Where a spade will be called a spade. Every time. Shove the political correctness. Join Shivani Gupta on Plain Speak at these times on CNN News 18. Sitaro ke aage jahan aur bhi hai, abhi ishq ke intihan aur bhi hai. Ye award ek garib aur pichde rajy Bihar ke liye hai, jo dhire-dhire tarakki ke raaste par par hai. Thank you very much. I, I didn't know that I would be here myself. Thank you. Who will be the CNN News 18 Indian of the Year 2022 for politics category? Catch the grand finale of the most awaited news event, CNN News 18 Indian of the Year 2022. Ladies and gentlemen, let me now take this opportunity to call up on stage our managing editors, Mr. Zaka Jacob and Mr. Anand Narsimhan on stage. Ladies and gentlemen, a huge round of applause, please. Namaste. Jai Hind, thank you very, very much. After four years, we are back with Indian of the Year 2022. And after four years, all of you are back with us. So big round of applause to all of you. Thank you very much. Now thing is, this man here has been uh, <laughs> saddled or, or shouldering the weight of CNN News 18. Two years ago? Yes, two years ago. Two years ago, two years. But it feels and like four. It feels, it's okay. it feels like four. But what's happened in the last six months, Zaka? As we bring up Indian of the Year 2022, there is also a reason for all of us as CNN News 18 celebrate.
So let's start from there. So as you heard the leadership AV a moment ago, ever since the ratings came back, which is I think in March of 2022, CNN News 18 for the last 24 weeks has been the number one English news channel in this country. <laughs> Going to show that you don't need to shout, you don't need to heckle, you don't need to throw barbs at people. You can do good old fashioned journalism and people will watch. So that's something that we are very, very proud of. And thank you, the viewers who have made that possible. We're good old fashioned journalism by a very, very young team. So, so, so that, that, that's us. So kudos to all of you too. Big shout out to all those people who have put this effort because once we come to the grand finale, everybody forgets the work that's happened at the back end. So right now, live on television, before we start the event, I'm going to say a big shout out to the entire tech crew, people who are sitting behind that screen making this happen, and those who are there outside. Big shout out, and I request all of you to please join me in, in congratulating them. But now, Indian of the Year 2022. So four-year hiatus. Yeah. Last two years, largely COVID. Yeah. So when we sat down, and when you said, let's bring Indian of the Year back, the first thing was Indian of the Year 2020, 2021, 2022, or Indian of the Year 2022. Did it start from there? It was, it was always going to be the awards for the year. As you said, over the last couple of years, because of the pandemic, life was not normal. We could not have had a gathering like this. We could not have had a 500-seat uh, auditorium in a hotel room with people interacting without worrying about social distancing, without worrying about, uh, you know, COVID kahan se aa jayega and, and all of that. So the first thing was that, yes, we are back to a semblance of normalcy, so we should do this event. That, that was the first thing. The second thing was, has enough happened in the year 2022, whether it's in politics, whether it's in sports, whether it's in entertainment. And of course, we've added a couple of new categories as well this year. I'll tell you about that in a moment. But the conclusion that we came to was, yes, if we have to revive Indian of the Year, this is the year to do it. And now is the time to do it. So well, a big absolutely. round of applause to the entire team that has put together Indian of the Year. It's a marquee property. It's the only property that we as CNN News 18 have had since the establishment of this channel. Way back from 2005, six, we've had 11 editions so far. Tonight is the 12th edition. So thank you very much for making this happen. Now, there may be some would be saying 2005, 2022, 12th edition. Well, there were interruptions in between. Lastly, like uh, COVID uh, took away two, uh, two years. Then before that, 2019, we had the Balakot strike, which happened just around the time we were doing India Rising. Remember all of that? So hey, it's been exciting, but it's been a fantastic journey. The Hall of Fame, to, the, to your left and to your right, ladies and gentlemen, are our past winners across various categories. It's the who's who. And there is not one person who you'd say, isko kyun diya? This time around, we have a problem of plenty again, Zakha. <laughs> Every category, there has been a difference of opinion ki kisko de raha hai. Even with our voters who voted on IndianOfTheYear.com. Yeah. So basically, we divided the uh, categories into five, uh, six in fact, uh, from politics, sports, entertainment. This year, we've started Climate Warrior uh, because we believe that climate change is a very, very pertinent problem of our times. And therefore, this was our effort to try and recognize uh, the efforts of ordinary Indians in battling climate change. Uh, the business category has been changed to startups because, as you are all aware, India today is the land of startups. We have more than 100 unicorns that are oh, valued over a billion dollars. So this year, we have started the Indian of the Year startup category. So in all of these categories, what we did was we had public voting, which was open from the middle of September till Gandhi Jayanti, the 2nd of October. We closed the public voting on the 2nd of October, after which our jury, the Network 18 editorial board, comprising of the best editors of this network, sat down and then analyzed every category, every nominee, and you wouldn't believe it that some of the discussions that the jury had was fascinating to know how people are thinking. And I can assure you, there was a sea change in the way in which we were approaching different categories and different winners. Uh, for example, and I think this is something, uh, a standout for me, the maximum number of public votes. Do you know which categories got uh, the maximum number of public votes? Let, let's ask them. Do you know which are the six categories? Okay, then take a guess. Okay, so we got sports, we've got entertainment, there's politics, there is startups, there is social change, there is climate warriors. Six categories. Any guesses? Anybody, put your hand up and say, kaha pe sabse zyada vote mila hoga? 
startups. Somebody said startup. Anybody who wants to say entertainment? Climate warriors. Somebody said climate warriors. Sports. Yeah. I sports sports. But so here's the interesting thing. It was not film stars, it was not sports persons. The highest category that got the maximum number of people votes was social change. The second was climate warrior. Can you believe it, ladies and gentlemen? People are voting for ordinary Indians who are making a 